everybody. Paul Brooks here from B-Movie Mania. And I have something special in front of me today. And I hope that this video is going to be a little special Halloween treat for all of the B-Movie Maniacs out there. We're going to do a little ASMR video today and check out this oldies.com catalog of TV shows and movies on DVD. I have my best AM ASMR voice for you tonight. So sit back, relax. Hopefully you have some headphones on. If not, that's okay. We're going to check out this entire catalog and see if we can find some good deals. So here we go. Oldies.com is a website that is very dangerous to me because they have a lot of great movies for pretty cheap prices. This is the October 2021 edition of their catalog. And as you can see, there's a special Halloween section and it's pretty large, pages 21 to 81. That is a whole lot of Halloween. On the cover here, we have some famous universal monsters. The Creature from the Black Lagoon Legacy Collection. The Invisible Man Complete Legacy Collection. And the Wolfman Complete Legacy Collection. I'm a big fan of the Universal Monsters. But I don't know that I have any of these particular DVDs. So I may have to pick some of these up. Down here we have the Army of Darkness Screwhead Edition DVD. In the middle we have the Frankenstein Complete Legacy Collection. And as you can see here on the bottom of all the... Well, it's a bit obscured up here, but you can see here all eight films from the original Legacy. And then over here, the original classic Alfred Hitchcock film, Psycho. So right off the bat on the cover here, we have a fantastic selection of DVDs to choose from. And as you can see, we have free shipping on orders over $75. Oldies.com, or you can call their number. All right, let's open this bad boy. nice and centered for you. All right. Inside this issue, wow, 1,800 movies and TV shows on sale. Look at this. We have Christine. We have House of Wax. We have a Hammer Films collection right there. The Mummy. Horror of Dracula. An 80s classic right here, Fright Night. Vincent Price in The Tingler. And The Bad Seed. And in the middle here is a listing of all the different genres within the catalog. Amazing. 
amazing, amazing selection. So we will start with the action-adventure genre here on page three. I'll get some nice page sounds in here for you. And obviously we are not going to go through every single movie, but let's just hit some of the highlights. Bad Blonde, that sounds interesting. Oh, $19, that's a little pricey for my taste. Battle Girl, Batwoman, and the Panther Women. Here's Black Shampoo. This movie was directed by Mr. Graydon Clark, who I interviewed for B-Movie Mania. I will leave a link down below to my in-depth interview with him if you care to check it out. Here we have something called Chick Fight. Quentin Tarantino's Death Proof. Death Ranch. Euro Trash Cinema. And then something here called the Fear, which it doesn't look to be the 1996 Mark Wahlberg movie Fear. In fact, it may stand for something else, but this is a movie that our friends over at Describe Fear, the podcast, may want to look into at some point. Describe Fear, this one is for you. Fighting with Kit Carson. The Green Hornet. Hatched. Should I read all of these? I feel like that would be too much. I'm just going to hit the highlights if that's okay with you guys. Hollywood Vice Squad. I feel like I've heard quite a bit about this movie, but I don't believe I've ever seen it. Carrie Fisher is in it. IP Man, Kung Fu Master. Jane and the Lost City. If there's any movies that I'm skipping over that you uh, enjoy or have something to say about yourself, please feel free to leave a comment down below and tell us why you uh, like any of these particular films. Oh, here's something that we watched for the B-Movie Marathon a couple years ago. The Man Who Killed Hitler and then The Bigfoot, starring Sam Elliott. That was a Chris Hudson pick. Money Plane, I've heard some things about this one here. Murder Rap, wow, what is that all about? Sounds pretty interesting. Psychotronica. SOS Coast Guard. Oh, Bella Lugosi's in that one. Some Street Fighter action right there. You can get Baby Mama if you'd like. see this okay in the camera. The back of the magazine is a little sticky. There we go. Okay. I've heard something 
about this boys from County Hell. That is pretty pricey right there. The thing is, they do have some great, great deals in this magazine, or in this catalog, excuse me. See right here, Wolfhead is on sale for $3.98. Can't beat that. Okay, well, we're in the comedy section now. Moving on to page eight. Some Charlie Chaplin. Ed and his dead mother. What is that all about? The Fire Sign Theater. this a hillbilly comedy collection hot dog the movie I would like to see that one some Buster Keaton and some Sam Kinison Some interesting looking stuff. 
in here. Black Pit of Dr. M. Wow. What's that one all about? I don't know. And now, as you can see, we are getting to the bread and butter of what we do here. Some horror movies. Let's check it out. Look at this. Here's a couple of uh, ten movie collections. Rise of the Undead. I'm sure I have some of these right here. I eat your skin. Okay, here we go. Some more ten movie horror collections. I've always been curious about this series right here. Eleven, eleven, eleven. And then you have twelve, 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 and thirteen, thirteen, thirteen. I don't believe I've seen any of them before. Here's a four film blade collection. Another five uh, collection, five movie collection of horror classics. I have several of these. Here's, of course, the classic George Romero film, Night of the Living Dead in a six horror movie collection with some other classic films right there. Look at that, only $3.49. A lot of these movies right here are quite cheap. Yeah, even the uh, 11, 11 series are $3.98. Pretty great. I have this movie right here, Seven Sins of the Vampire. Eight horror movies. Beast from the Haunted Cave. The Beast of Yucca Flats. The Corpse Vanishes. Some of my favorites right there. The ABCs of Death 2. There's the original Alien and the new Alien Covenant. This is a giallo movie called All the Colors of the Dark. I have seen this one. I remember enjoying it quite a bit. 19 bucks. American Backwoods. That's weird. Why is American Warships in the horror section. Must be a horror movie. Here's the American Werewolf in London and in Paris. An Amityville movie at the bottom here. Sorry, my cat is talking to me. An Amity Amityville movie, Amityville Witches. Oh, more Amityville up top here on page 24. The Amityville Horror Triple Feature. Amityville Horror, Amityville 2, and Amityville 3. More Amityville Horror at the top of page 24. The Amityville or Amityville 2 and Amityville 3. This is an interesting title, Anatomy of a Psycho. 1961, wow. Here's Annabelle. And uh, Annabelle Comes Home and Annabelle Creation. I have not seen any of those myself. There's a zombie movie called Anonymous Zombie. Anything for Jackson. The Ape. The Ape Man. Apocalypse and the Beauty Queen. Arachnophobia. 
again there is Army of Darkness, The Astral Factor, Asylum. Wow, here's 13 movies in one collection. $6.98. Not too bad. Attack of the Giant Leeches. Love that one. An Aussie Horror Collection. The Babadook.
some of the Camp Blood films. Candyman 3. Here's one of my absolute favorites, Carnival of Souls. John Carpenter. Carrie. Castle Freak. Cat People. Here's one that I absolutely love as well. This film is called Cauldron Baptism of Blood. It is directed by Ted V. Michaels. Also, rest in peace. This film right here is, in my opinion, pretty underrated. It's called The Chernobyl Diaries. I would recommend checking out that one right there. Children shouldn't play with dead things. Some child's play movies. Chopping Mall. Christine. The classic zombies. Classic horror. Okay, what else we got here? Color Out of Space. Here is the Conjuring series, including the brand new one. 28 bucks for that. Here's a Roger Corman collection. It says Volume 2. Some really good stuff on that. Teenage Doll, Little Shop of Horrors, Attack of the Giant Leeches, The Fall of the House of Usher, the Terror, and Monster from the Ocean's Floor. Here's another one from Ted V. Michaels, The Corpse Grinders. I own this one right here. I own on DVD. And of course, The Corpse Grinders 2 and 3. Here is The Craft. Creature from the Haunted Sea, another Roger Corman film. The Creeps. Creep Show. Crimson Peak. Here is the original Critters. That was a B-movie marathon pick several years back. Ah, here we go. The Four Film Critters Collection. This is the one that I own for the first four Critters films on two DVDs. Cult of Chucky. Some Bigfoot films here. Dumber versus Casey, oh jeez. This film was pretty interesting. This is a shutter film called The Dark and the Wicked. It is, well, it's very dark. Dark Dreamers, Dark Moon Thriller Collection. Day of the Animals. George Romero's Day of the Dead. The Dead Hate the Living. Deadly Blessing. is a movie called Deathbed, starring Joe Estevez, and that is not to be confused with Deathbed, the bed that eats, but I do own this film on V. 
VHS, believe it or not. Decadent Evil, that is a film that is very near and dear to our hearts here at B-Movie Mania. Deep Blue Sea, that was a good one. Dementia 13. Here's another Ted V movie called Demon Haunt. I actually bought this one not too long ago. Demonic, starring Tom Savini. Special effects master. Here are the Demons films. and The Dentist 2. That's a great movie right there. The Descent. Oh, look at this. The, the Devil at Work. Six tales of those who sell their souls. Lots of devil movies going on right there. And all the way over here as well. Die Hard Dracula, that's an interesting title. Don't Look in the Basement. There is the original Dracula with Bella Lugosi. So much horror in this catalog, but I could do this all night. I saw this in the theater in Los Angeles, Dracula Untold. Ega, that's a mystery science theater staple. Oh, look at this, some Elvira movie macabre. Embalmer. Wow, that is quite the title right there. Entrails of a Beautiful Woman. Wow. Here is David Lynch's Eraser Head. There is so much stuff in this catalog it is almost overwhelming to be honest something called the fear makers wow look at this all three of the feast movies on dvd Some Final Destination films, as well as Firestarter, and we have Flatliners and The Fog, and some more fog right here. This is a B-movie marathon classic right there, Frankenhooker, by Frank Hannon Lauder. Is the Frankenstein collection and actually lots more Frankenstein right here if you are a Frankenstein fan and then of course we have some Friday the 13th and a nightmare on Elm Street Freddy's dead the final nightmare Versus 
this evil bomb. Grave of the Vampire. Some Gremlins films right here. of Grindhouse double features. And some more Grindhouse movies at the top of page 46. I enjoyed this one right here. This is called Gwen. Here are some of the Conrad Brooks films I mentioned earlier. Super, super, super low budget and super fun. I never, I have not seen Rob Zombie's Halloween. Never got around to that one. But I did see the 2018 Halloween. I have seen Halloween too. Believe it or not, I've never seen Halloween 3, which some people seem to love and some people really do not care for it. Some Hammer Films collections right there. Happy Death Day. Hatchet 2. Love this movie right here, Head of the Family, directed by Charles Band. Uh, fun fact, me and Jason Halls met the director of this film, Charles Band, one time in um, Little Rock, Arkansas. Hell House LLC, Hellraiser 2, Hellbound, the original Hellraiser, Hereditary, Highway to Hell, love this one so much, Highway to Hell. Here's another B-movie marathon alum, this is called Hillbilly Monster. Another movie directed by Mr. Conrad Brooks. Okay, over here on page 49, we have a lot of horror movie collections, 20 pack. This one right here is 50 movies. Look at all that. That is not bad for 28 bucks. This one is 60 films. All sorts of different collections in here. Here's another B-movie marathon pick. Horrors of Spider Island. Of course you have Hostel, which I have not seen, but a lot of people seem to enjoy that one. A lot of people were talking about a host last year. House on Haunted Hill from well, starring Vincent Price. And the House on Haunted Hill remake. The Howling. Bella Lugosi in The Human Monster. I eat your skin. I know what you did last summer trilogy. I spit on your grave triple feature. 
we have a friend who worked on, I believe, the first I Spit on Your Grave remake. Idle Hands. Insidious 3. Interview with the Vampire. Here's one of my personal favorites. The Ironbound Vampire. This is a film that we reviewed on our B-Movie Mania TV show. And we also played this for one of the B-Movie marathons. So, really big fan of this one right here. The Ironbound Vampire. Here's the Invisible Man collection. The It Films, all right here. Another Conrad Brooks film, Jan Gel, The Beast from the East, and The Beast Returns. Of course, you have some Jaws films here. Jigsaw. Killjoy. The Killer Shrews. Killjoy 2 and 3. I own these two right here. King Kong Escapes and King Kong vs. Godzilla. Some Stephen King. Oh, what is this? Kung Fu Zombies. Five bucks. That one looks like a lot of fun. Lady Frankenstein. I own that one. Of course, Vincent Price in The Last Man on Earth. Leatherface, The Texas Chainsaw Massacre 3. I'm a big fan of this one as well. Here we have a 8-film collection of Leprechaun down in the corner of page 55. The horror just seems to go on forever. The Lost Boys. I believe I own this movie right here. Lucker the Necroph... Ne Necrophagus, I guess that's how you say that. Okay, Mandy, Maniac Cop. Here we have Manos, the Hands of Fate. Two different versions. The Manster. Okay, Messiah of Evil. Midnight Horror Movie Collections. Midnight Movie. Midsommar. Ooh, what is this right here? The Ted V. Michaels Bloodbath Collection. Female Slaves Revenge. Dimension in Fear. Cauldron and the Corpse Grinders 3. That's fun. Here is the movie The Mist. Don't talk to Jay about that one. He is still processing the ending of this film. Lots of monsters. Whoa. Here 
is an entire page of something called Mr. Lobo's Cinema Insomnia. He must be like a horror host similar to uh, Sven Gulli or Elvira. The Mummy. Moving on to page 62, we have Night of the Demons 2, we have some more Conrad Brooks, a Night of the Living Dead, several of them actually. Here's a documentary about George Romero called Document of the Dead, Night of the Living Dead 3D starring Sid Haig. Another Night of the Living Dead. Moving on to page 63. One of me and Mike's all-time favorites right there, Orgy of the Dead, written by Ed Wood. Okay, Phantasm. Wow. Okay. 
Okay, I love that title. Sex, Sexcula. Oh man, I own this one. I'm gonna have to pick this for the marathon some year. Shadow Dead Riot, starring Tony Todd. William Shatner's Full Moon Fright Fest. Fright Night, excuse me. Hideous. The Shining. The Shocker, we played that one year. Slacks. Sleepwalkers. Slugs. Son of the Blob. Oh. See this movie here? You know how you pronounce that movie? That's how you say it. Stir of Echoes. D. Snyder's Strange Land. Jay picked this one up for me recently. Jay, thank you for picking that one up. Street Trash. Of course, I have to mention the stuff. This one is in our B-movie Hall of Fame. Suspiria. Tales from the Crypt and Tales from the Dark Side and Tales of Dracula and Tales of Frankenstein and Tales of Terror and more Tales of Terror and Tales of Voodoo. Okay, that's enough tales. Yep, it's really an overwhelming amount of horror films in this catalog. Of course, you have The Thing, although that's actually the remake. 13 Ghosts, The Tingler, Toolbox Murders, some toxic adventure films right here. Tremors. Several Tremors films right here. Trick or Treat. A lot of people enjoy this one. Trilogy of Terror. Uncle Sam. A little bit of a spoiler for any fans of the podcast. I believe we are going to be reviewing this film for season six of the podcast. Okay, look at all of these vampire films. Vamp, that's a great film. Vampire Bat. Vampire Journals is great. Here's the Ironbound Vampire again. So much good stuff in here. Okay. Nearing the end of the catalog here, folks. Wasp Woman. Werewolf of Washington. I believe I own that one. I like that title, What the Peeper Saw. White Zombie, The Wicker Man, The Witch, or The VV Itch. Ed Wood Tribute. I own that one as well. Wolf Cop. The Worm Eaters. And there we go, we are moving into mystery slash thriller. Uh, here is the end of the horror section right up top here. 
Zombie Decadence, we reviewed this one uh, for season one of the podcast, Zombie Land. And now we have some mystery and thriller films. Not too many because we are already moving into the sci-fi and fantasy section. The Green Hornet. And now some television. And I'm going to just briefly flip through these pages for you. Some war and westerns. And again, this is not, not really the sort of stuff that we do much on the podcast, so we'll just show you all of this briefly. Oh, this is interesting. The Alpha Video Rewind series. The Astral Factor. Nice cover art on some of these. And we are getting to the very end here, folks. Some more of the Alpha Rewind series. Silent Night, Bloody Night. Star Odyssey, Werewolf of Washington. And then here is an order form if you want to do things the old school way. Have a safe and happy Halloween.